West Wolf, a 22-year-old Native woman, was walking home on Flathead Reservation when she was struck and killed by a Cadillac Escalade driven by white nationalist Sonny K. White. Micah was declared dead at the scene, and there was no evidence to suggest that White tried to slow or stop prior to hitting her. Sonny White's two children, Arian and Nation, were both in the car when Micah was killed. While this took place on tribal land, jurisdiction falls to highway patrol and is being classified as a fatal crash. Because of that, the case is not being prioritized and Sonny White has yet to face any charges. This is not just a fatal crash. This is a homicide and a hate crime and needs to be investigated as such. Micah's aunt has asked for your help to push this case into the hands of the FBI and demand that it be investigated as more than just a fatal car accident. She has compiled a list of easy ways to help, including a letter draft to Montana representatives and a draft to report this as a hate crime to the FBI. Please take a moment to be Micah's voice and get Sunny K. White off the street before she can target another indigenous woman. I want to end this video with a little more about Micah. Micah Josephine Westwolf was an enrolled member of the Blackfeet tribe and was also Diné, Cree, and Klamath. She was described as a writer, hiker, dancer, and so much more. She was selected for an indigenous cultural exchange and spent time with the Sherpa people of Nepal. She was athletic, loving anything from snowboarding to basketball to running. Micah was creative and won awards for both poetry and videography. She eventually wanted to raise chickens and grow a garden. Her parents remember her love for her family, passion for her culture, and gift for writing. Heaven on earth is what we seek, but we forget there is beauty in the ugly. Oh, how life would be if there was no ugly, no struggle, just everything we need was guaranteed.